Hello everyone. This is uh, Claude Tour, Cla Craig Claude with Claude Tour Manufacturing. Today we're going to do another lathe practice. What we're going to do is we're going to do a rough and finish outside diameter of a lathe part. Okay, so let's get right into it. And I hope you're enjoying this stuff. Let's rip this lathe up and let's see what we can do. All right. So first thing we want to do is we got our partner stock set up for my last video. All right. Now what we're going to do is we're going to come in here. We're gonna make a new level. We're gonna to have to call this Op One Sketch, okay? Because you need a 2D sketch, not a big deal, right? Go to wireframe, grab your line, whatever you need to do. You need to outline. You need to get your outline of your your model, okay? You got to hit Q for quadrant if it's circles, okay? I'm gonna go all the way down to the zero. Okay, so that's basically what I just did as I put this line in here. And now we're going to connect these lines across here. So all I'm doing here is I'm just giving you a 2D outline of the part where I want to cut it. Because I want to cut this, rough this off, okay? So now what we're going to do is we're going to trim entities. We're going to extend. Oh, that's not there anymore. Modify length by 50 thou. I always just like to do that at the end here to make sure it goes off that. All right, not a big deal. Go to your turning, go to rough. Okay. I'm going to start from that bottom chain and I'm going to go up like that. All right, and I just simply pick that. Now it's, I'm already selected. I'm going to grab this OD right turn tool. I'm going to double click that. I'm just going to make sure you're going to come in here and you're going to change your corner radius to where you have it at. Not a big deal. Your diameter of your insert, you know, and you can change your holder up if you want to. All right, and then here's your parameters. All right. These are pretty simple parameters. Let's say we're cutting aluminum. We're going to go in your roughing parameter. I have it set at 100 thou. And the stocks leave it at 5 thou there. Entry amount 100 thou. Okay, that looks good. My direction. That looks like the direction I want it to be in. Let's see what we got. See, now look at that. It automatically takes that stock away for you. It shows you a trim out of your toolpath to make sure it verifies it right there for you. All right. So then what you want to do is you got your lathe tool in there and you, you did the rough. Now we want to finish past that sucker. We're just going to do the last, last selection. Now we're just going to, I want to get a finer tool in there. Okay. And let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's re click that, go into your, uh, go into your parameters here, finish step over. Let's do a finish step over of 5,000. Let's do two passes. Okay. Green check. There you go. Well, I don't like that lathe number. I don't want a 12. I want it to be tool two. So make sure your coolant's on too. So there you have it. There is how you finish in rough turn. Now let's graphic verify this. You're gonna come up here, select both your tool paths. You're gonna come up here and grab verify selection operations. And it's gonna pop up. See that? Look at that, sweet. Let's hit play. There you go. Wham wham. And when we're done. I will definitely, um, when we're done here, we're going to do another tutorial next week on how to drill and tap this thing and maybe do some OD threads on the other side or something. I'm not quite sure. But I hope you enjoyed this. All right, thank you. And, uh, let me get my file up here. There's something I'm missing here. My levels. There we go. Didn't have my model up. You got to have your model up for this to work. And you're very, otherwise, I ain't got no model to read. So I just wanted to make sure that I'm doing all this right. Okay, see, I'm holding on to the chuck right where I told it to. Now I'm going to do a graphic verify within one thou. To change that one thaw, you go to this compare options, click that, turn it to one thaw. Now you can see I'm cutting this right to where my radius is. There's a relief in the print. Okay. There you have it. That is how you turn a lathe part in MasterCam. 
All right, thank you. I appreciate it.